For over 85 years, Bradley's has repaired the critical electric motors that keep Corpus Christi's refineries and plants operating. Take the tour. Visit bradleysmotors.com. A bouncing ball off the foot of Evan Grills, picked up by the shortstop Mayfield. He has no play. Across first base with a uh, single Juan Herrera, and that's how this uh, Cardinals third begins. And Rodney Linares, the Hooks manager, goes out to check on Grills. Grills talking with uh, the home plate umpire, Cal McCready. Now they're chatting with Seha and Cody Oaks. I think they're trying to discuss whether that ball ever hit the ground or if it came off the top of his foot. Now that's very interesting. Love to see this uh, replay. I thought Rodney was out to check on Grills. In fact, Hooks are contending this, uh, as Gene said, never hit the turf. And we're seeing a replay here, Gene. And I think they're right. It hit the top of the shoe of Evan Grills. Now that ball never hit the ground. Now whether they actually were, were able to see that well enough to make the call and reverse it or not, but um, it's pretty clear from the replay that that line drive hit the top of his foot, bounced up in the air, and uh oh, they're about uh. to oh, they're going to change it. <laughs> <laughs> they. The uh, umpiring crew, uh, McCready and Seha, went, went toward the Cardinal bench and then looked back to the uh, Springfield manager, Dan Bellardello, and Bellardello is furious. So Bellardello is in the third base coach's box. Now he's confronting both Seha and McCready here. And, uh, of course, this umpiring crew has ejected two individuals in this series. And Bellardello is smoking hot right now. He's he's upset. Well, you could tell immediately that Grills looked at the home plate umpire and said, that ball never hit the ground. But that was Grills' contention from the very beginning or right after the play was over. 